What's going on guys? Seth from Schmick Squadron coming back at you with another video. This time, UDS Top 8. Uh, I would go over Top 32, but it's usually not as important for the UDS. I know there was quite a bit of Spiral. I believe there was like 6 Spiral. Alter guys, I believe Infernoid was in there. Shadol, there was like 3 Shadol invoked in there. Uh, a Rocket in there. 3 Salomon Great. Uh, so on and so forth. No Orcus as well. So, our top eight was uh, two Spiral, one being a Scrap variant, two Lunalite, one being, I believe, a um, Zoo uh, Lunalite, and then the other one is posted as, like, Utopic Lunalite, interestingly enough. Um, two Shadal invoked. Shadal coming out swinging with the inv with the new structure deck, with the invoked at its side. Very, very powerful, it looks like. It's going to be a very good front runner for the new meta, breaking boards. And then you had uh, Rockets. Rocket Dragon Link, which really wasn't even much of a Dragon Link so much as more like a pure rocket from what I could tell. Summoning stuff like Striker Dragon uh, quite a bit, and from what we could tell from his feature match, like Triple Burst Dragon, Quad Barrel, or Boral Dragon, uh, Abomination, Keeper of the Shrine in his deck as well, so, uh, and three Safer as well. So, I don't have any of the deck lists on hand. If I do, if I can find any, I'll post it, I'll put it like right here or right here. Um, if not, it just means I couldn't find any at the time. I am recording this right after the two decks and the two, and there was a top, I'm going to top four. There was, I believe it was, um, Shadal Invoked, Rockets, Dinos, and Spiral once again, I believe. Either that or it was Luna Light? One of the two. Um, but I know for sure it was Dino. Rocket, um, should all invoke, and I do believe it was Spiral, yes. So, cut down to top two, and we have should all invoked, and we have Rockets. And wouldn't you know it, Rocket won. Rocket actually won the fucking event. That's nuts. Man, shout out to, uh, I, I'm not gonna say his name because I'm just gonna butcher it, but shout out to, I believe his name's like Sh uh, Shun. I'm gonna call him Shun. If I say that name wrong, I'm very sorry. Regardless, coming out swinging with Rocket, and then Shadal coming out swinging as well, taking two of the spots in top eight, and then Dino taking top eight as well. This is really nice. This is honestly really good. It shows a really good format that we have ahead of ourselves. If, if the UDS is anything to go off of, which I believe it is, because after t they do 12 rounds of Swiss, Cut the top eight, and then if you're in top eight, you do top eight, top four, and then final. So after 15 games, it's a long tournament. Now, I'm not really sure about Rocket. That could have just been something that off the wall could have won. Um, who knows, though? Striker Dragons won hell of a card. Uh, Collapse Serpents and uh, Collapse Serpent and Wyver Burst are, are great too. Dragon Shrine, the Rockets, Abomination can all kind of fit in to bring a coherent strategy. Um, definitely interesting though. Definitely interesting. Boot Sector Launch being one hell of a card. Let's just say that for sure. Then we have Shadal Invoked. I did. I haven't seen his list yet, but as far as I'm aware, uh, it's probably just about like everything, like every other one, especially adding in the new Wind. Wind and uh, Winda and Ariel, so making a very formidable Shadal deck there. Um, but our top four being very diverse, and then even top eight being diverse with two Spiral. Of course, this is the front runner of the meta. Uh, no Geist making it in surprisingly. Uh, I'm very surprised about that, and no Salad in there either. Again, I mentioned they were in top 32, but not in the top eight. But at least if you were top 32 in a YCS, possibly these decks could have gone the distance. We'll just have to see. But I wanted to talk, I wanted to jump on this just because I want to see what your guys' thoughts are. What do you think of Rockets winning? I mean, I think it's pretty surprising. I'm not sure it'll stick for long. Could be something like prank kids coming around where they win something and then they kind of slowly move out. But you never know. 
Shadal also, like I said, Shadal coming out swinging and proving itself as a good staple for this deck. It won the card market. It's been winning some regionals. And uh, Sam, actually, from Team Sam, I'll leave the link in the description, actually won his uh, UDS kind of tournament going undefeated with Shadal's. Has Mech Knight, has Mech Knights in there um, invoked and Shadal, so very interesting there. Definitely a good strategy for going second as it can break boards. Spirals, of course, being up there as a front as the front runner. No surprise there. And Dinos came, coming out swinging. Dinos definitely look like a very good contender here. So I'm just going to give my thoughts on that. Look out for that deck. Until then, though, guys, this is just a short video giving my thoughts on the top eight of the UDS. Big surprise here. We're just going to have to see how much the meta shapes up after this. But until then, peace.